Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Want Less Object. Unfortunately, today's video is not going to be a turning video. Uh, I don't have the content tab yet on my on my channel. I don't I don't I don't meet the requirements yet, so I can't just make a quick little written post. So I thought I'd make a quick quick video just to let everybody know what's going on. For the, for you know for the people who are uh, looking forward to seeing my video. Uh, so, the part I'm doing on the lathe right now, uh, I'm in the middle of it. I had to stop a little over a week ago on that project. Uh, first of all, I misidentified the piece of stock that I was using. I had I had said that this was a piece of that this was a piece of end grain walnut, and you know because it's been sitting around my house for a couple years. It's really super super dry. There's no bark on it. Uh, and like I said, it's been around here for a long time. So, and I didn't mark it. So I don't really, didn't really remember what kind of wood it actually was. Well, as it turns out, uh, I think it's actually a piece of Osage orange. Now the piece that's in the machine is equal to the size of this one when it started out. That being said, uh, a little bit about safety. So all the turning that I've done on that project so far, I did not wear a respirator. I don't usually wear a respirator when I'm doing the turning work. Uh, I've never really had any issues with that. I always wear a respirator when I'm doing my finishing processes. So, because this is end grain, and because it's so dry, it's making nothing but it's making nothing but dust. I mean, that that's what it's doing. It's all powder, and that stuff was everywhere, and it got into my it got into my head, into my throat, into my lungs. I had to go to the doctor. Uh, I got severe infection. I'm on all kinds of medicines and steroids and all kinds of stuff. Uh, I'm not ready to get back underneath the mask yet because uh, you know that whole area is still pretty sensitive. So my word, you know, a word to the wise: whenever you are turning, whenever you're doing your turnings on your lathes or wherever, or however you're doing it. My suggestion is wear the mask because, you know, I didn't think I'd ever get sick sick from that, but it, it it really did a number on me. So I've learned my lesson. I will from now on wear my mask during all of the operations because, yeah, I, I feel terrible. It sucks. So I just want to let everybody know that hopefully next week I'll be able to get a video posted. I'll be able to get back down here and get back to it, but I can't do it until I get until I get better, until I can breathe underneath the mask. So... Uh, like I said, this was this was for anybody who watches my channel or is looking forward to the videos or, or cares. Once I get a comment tab, I won't have to make little videos like this. So, okay, everybody. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Uh, we'll see you as soon as I get this video posted. Thank you.